last bit here. And I got a fun and exciting product for you today for Hayes from McCain Craft Beer Better Chips and Kale Ale. And they contain real beer too. If you don't believe me, here's the ingredients list. It's going to be exciting. Australia is a bunch of closeted alcoholics, so let's see what these are really like. Got a batch on standby, pretty cool, ready to roll. Here's what a good one looks like. Just a chip, for all intents and purposes. I feel a little bugger, look at that. Magnificent. It does taste like beer. I'm not really drinking myself. Barely do it. But that really does taste like beer. It's light, it's fresh. It's just a hint of alcohol and flavouring. I have to have the second one so I can formulate some more opinions. Look at that whopper. Batters, look at that. Polarization. You know it's flavored, this burger. Ah, there it is. This is like a nice pint of beer. Someone's dehydrated, a nice, light, crisp, refreshing pint of beer. It's sprinkled that dehydrated dust on a chip. A very light, fluffy. Beautiful chip, it really is a beautiful chip. So I'm not much of a drink, I don't know if I'm on whether the beer dust is any good or not, but as a chip, magnificent. As beer flavor chips, not disgusting. Some of them have been out been around before and are horrible. In a country of alcoholics, you love our beer flavoured stuff. This would be the perfect snack to a compliment on, say, you're know, watching the football, hell, the cricket in summer and in the Commonwealth nations, Australia, where this product comes from. I know nothing about the brand either, John Boston, because I'm not a drinker, so all I can review is the chips. They have very nice chips, very tasty chips. They would make a great snack. Or a, um, one of these things the feminazis despise, an old fashioned bloke. Get the wife to whip up and batch while you and your mates watch the footy or the cricket if it's summer. These would be amazing. Let's all out. <laughs>